date on this note is May 22nd, 2015, correct? That is correct. That was during our honeymoon period. So this is just a little bit over two months after the events in Australia in March of 2015, right? That's correct. We were back in a honeymoon phase. That was the period of sobriety I spoke about yesterday. When Mr. Depp, after Mr. Depp had allegedly assaulted you with a bottle, right? It was after the stairs and it was after the Australia incident, yes. And, and he got clean and sober and we went back to Australia. So it's also two months after Mr. you punched Mr. Depp because you allegedly thought he was going to throw your sister down the stairs, right? I hit him when he swung at my sister. And this is written months later, yes. You thought he was going to throw your sister down the stairs like he had thrown Kate Moss down the stairs, right? He swung at Whitney, and I had heard a rumor, a vague rumor about that. And so it's what I thought of. In this first message to Mr. Depp in your journal, you write, quote, true love isn't about just the madness of passion or instead picking the safety of peace. No, it's about having both, falling madly in love with your friend. That is what has surprised me perhaps the most, that I have seen in you the true bones of friendship and respect. But of course, I still, perhaps more than ever, want to rip you apart, devour you, and savor the taste. Fret not, XX Slim. Yes, it's a love note. Did I read that correctly? Yes, you but did. But I'm sure of one thing, and if it's that I can't imagine living, that I can't imagine my life without you. I love you. I will do better. I am sorry. X Slim. Did I read that correctly? That is correct. It's your testimony, this was a love journal? That is correct. It was primarily love notes and... And you know, apology over. notes from you to Mr. Depp? The book was more of a love notebook, um, and part of that communication, obviously, since we fought so much, uh, it was important for me to, um, you know, try to nurture as much peace as we possibly could. And when things were good, they were really good. And it was also an opportunity for you to apologize to Mr. Depp for your behavior, isn't it? I think it's important in every relationship to apologize when you're trying to move past fights.